Alright guys, welcome back to another video in Cooper Space program. This is Subscriber Designs Episode 6 and we are starting off with Concord. Now Concord is by Carve, that is his name. And thanks for the submission. He says that blah 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 nose pointing down. You can add things if you want, if you think it needs it. And he says if you fly it too high it will get out of control, which yeah, I think it will get out of control. And let's try it out. I like how he used these more hard points at the front. It's pretty cool. It's a good idea there. And of course everything is on an angle. It's it's okay. This should lift up nice and early. I haven't tested this out yet, so it's just trial and error here. Let's see if it works. Come on, lift up. Lifty lifty. At the end of the runway. Cool. Whoa. Haha. <laughs> it's still working. Wow. Good design. I like it. Let's try flying it. Come on, turn, turn. The other way, thank you. We only need two engines, correct? That's all we need. We don't need the other two. Yeah, that should do. Ah, let's just crash it. <laughs> I need to fix it up. Alright, be right back once it's fixed. Alright, I fixed up the design. Haven't tested it yet, but I fixed it up just by adding an extra hard point. Small hard point on both sides here, and it help us. That would definitely help us lift up nice and early. Sort of smashing at the end of the runway. Let's just look at it on the side here. And excellent. All right, lucky there. Very lucky. And let us fly it around. I won't take it up at a high altitude because Carve says that it will get out of control, and I think it will as well because I've looked at the center of mass and lift. And there's nothing that I can change with this design because this wing here is causing the problem. This big back wing here. So we are going to go to the other runway, try and land without crashing my game. And that will be it. Because we are going to go for the next design after that. Why are we going to the left? Why? Oh yeah, it's right. There's an apoapsis. It loves the apoapsis. Yeah, that's, that's a way to turn. Come on. Come on, come on. Thank you. There we go. And the next design after this will be either the Infinity Rover or... What was it? What was it? A spacecraft designed for low orbit. That's what it's called by Suit Creeper. So yeah. One of those, spacecraft or rover. Mm, which one's better? I was going for the Infinity Rover since that's second on my list. Go for that. And then we'll go for the the uh, rocket one. Should be good. Should be good. All right, we're almost there. Very close. Let us extend the smoggy bays, and we'll turn a little bit, just a little bit to the left. That way we can get a straight landing. Get a little bit closer to the ground. We can lift up last minute if we like. Throttle down even more. Just very gently. Of course, I do have caps lock on, as you can see in the bottom left-hand corner. Whoa. Lift up, lift, lift. Good lift rating. Now we have to turn just a little bit. Yep, that's pretty much perfect. I guess it's not. Turn, please. Thank you. Thanks. Lift up. Alright. There we go. And brakes. I think everything should be fine with the landing. Oh, by the way, I have a strut here con connecting these small hard points because they can be a little bit loose if you do so. Oh, you saw. Creating me. Look at this. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think of that would happen. I had the brakes on too. It took a while to slow down. And the wing bug. There it goes again. Wing. Alright, next design. This is Infinity Rover. It is by Gaitis XP. And he says that last time he was in Subscriber Designs video, I pronounced his name like a rooster. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Uh, he says that it's a rover using new part, pats, parts, is it pats here, from 0 0.19, one toggles the lights, I think I said enough, enjoy. Thank you, so one toggles the lights, one, yes, you are correct, one does indeed toggle the lights, 
Wait, what did you do here? Ah, oh, he double-sided the lights. Two lights in one. Awesome. Yeah, there are two eliminators. Mark 1 and Mark 2 here. <laughs> that's pretty funny. I like that. I like that a lot. Whoa, that's a lot of capsules. Wow. Hey, that's actually quite a good idea. Each one has an electric car. You can use them as a battery. Although there's battery packs here. They, they, these look big. I don't know. And a whole lot of that. Yeah. Alright, I like that. Let's check the battery. Electricity doesn't seem to go down at all. It's pretty much stable. Yeah, that's good. Cool design. I like it. Very cool. Nice basic. Maybe we'll go down there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nothing smashed yet. Ha! <laughs> awesome. Let's go down there. Ooh, we'll just be able to test the lights if we go down there. Come on. Lights. Lights. Yeah, they're working. They're working. Lights. Whee! This is fun just turning left and right. It's just great. I like this. And there's the lights. Looky, looky. On and off, on and off. Ah, uh, let's crash! That's a pretty funny crash. <laughs> Nothing happened, really. Just turned upside down. That's about it. Wow, that was pretty funny. Anyway, next design. This design here is by Suit Creeper. Thanks to this mission, this uh, spacecraft was designed for low orbit battle missions, but it has no weapons yet. Alright, no problem. Uh, follow, blah, 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 blah. I'm just reading. What he says, three seconds after the first ones have been released. Yeah, I think he was the one who said it was quite hard to use. I don't know. To launch this puppy up, you'll need... Ah, oh, okay. Throttle up halfway. Alright, let me try with try doing that. I haven't tested this out. That's why I'm reading the instructions. It's usually good to have like a first impression when I record. Record, so... Space bar. Oh, I can see what he means by hard to control. Definitely. Throw it down a little bit more, I think. Yeah. Just a little bit. Maybe go full throttle. That shouldn't be that bad. Why is it so shaky? Yeah, it really is shaky. You know what? You need uh, Suit Creeper for this design. You need to add a strut from this Rocket Max fuel tank to these fuel tanks down here. That will strengthen it up. I press spacebar. Oh, oh, wow. That's interesting. I've never seen that before. And then I'm assuming I'm going to press space bar now for these things to work. Right. I'm assuming. Oh yeah, then the final stage. Oh yeah, that's the final stage there. And then, oh no, that, that one there. Oh, okay, so this is a probe. Ah, oh, so you can dock. Cool, interesting. I like it. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, by the way, I never use Xeon engines. I really never use them. What was that? I thought something smashed. I guess not. Get ready, 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 space bar. Nothing smashed yet. Cool, I like that. Very nice, very nice. Something always smashes usually, but yeah. Seems good. I need to change the angle of this whole thing. I should have done that earlier on. We were just burning fuel. Okay, this is really shaky. I guess I can throttle down just a little bit. Just enough so we can steadily increase speed without smashing the whole ship and as you can see it's more stable now we are still going up increasing speed it is a success let's read the instructions quietly in my mind half blah 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 crash main entrance but we destroy them uh three single blah 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 really seven blah 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 twenty kilometers in the air what if you are above twenty kilometers up in the air or it will blow up your ship. Oh, okay, then choose your height. Orbit, kill the motors, then have a good luck with the ship. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I think I should have read that before I even started recording. Oh well, first impressions are good sometimes. Did something waste out of fuel? Yes. <laughs> something wasted. What am I saying? Yeah, alright, now. I'm just trying to get this in orbit. It's pretty much it. I'm going to throttle up. You know what you can do? Is you throttle up, but don't turn on SAS. Because SAS is the very thing that shakes the ship. Because look, look. SAS on. The ship is shaking. SAS off. The ship is no longer shaking. So sometimes you can... You don't really need SAS. You just manually control the ship yourself. It's okay. You can you can do it. Don't be lazy. 
and just very steadily just do that for a second and it works out nicely still have plenty of fuel wow still going and anytime now all right awesome I like the way that works cool what the heck what are you doing down there no no I didn't want that to happen I pretty much never go down that way with orbit always orbit around the 90 degree mark now we're going down it's horrible why all right I'm gonna turn off the engine fast forward a little bit go up to the Apple Apsis do I burn create an orbit plenty of fuel I think where yes too much fuel we do have too much fuel actually Let us we have RCS cool I guess we can just full throttle this yeah I don't think anything is gonna explode from overheating even this is a little bit shaky. Yep. Alright. Why don't I press N? There we go. We are successfully orbiting. Awesome. And there's too much fuel. Too way too much. Awesome. Yep, that's definitely a crash landing. Just keep on expanding this until the fuel wastes. Huh? Oh wait. Total up. Total down. Oh, that's right. We're going to the yeah, that way. And I'm assuming we can press space bar use this Xeon engine, although it's pretty much useless most of the time, doesn't really do anything. Do we have any parachutes? No we don't. We are doomed, that is a fact. Doomed I tell you. Yeah, alright, let's see we are where we are on the Come on. Oh I throttle them. That's right. We didn't waste out of fuel, did we? Ah, oh, still have some. Extend these just for fun. Fun sake. Just for fun. Oh, we're not fast forwarding. Good. Let's watch these parts just disintegrate in the air. We are going down that way, aren't we? Yeah. Let's point the probe towards that direction that we are heading. Right there. Awesome. Watch the magic happen. Can I screenshot this? Looks like a good screenshot. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? I don't know. That looks good. Now, just spamming it really. Alrighty. Now, overheat. Smash to pieces, panels. Now. Now. Now, you, you should have smashed to pieces by now. Why do I have SAS on? Whoa. 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 Screenshot for sure. It's definitely, that definitely deserves a screenshot. Damn, that's bright. How fast are we going? Oh wow. Okay. Wow. It was like 2,000 meters per second. Too fast. Very fast. <laughs> I like that. That's cool. Ah, uh, no more air. No. There's the air effects. You can barely see it. Okay, it's gone now. Now we are just falling. Falling. Fall down. And smash throttle up no okay <laughs> yeah I couldn't save it there was no parachute oh well uh, it wasn't designed for that okay anyway guys thank you for watching that is the end of this video okay I'd like to thank Suit Creeper Carve and Dritus XP sorry for pronouncing your name as a rooster I probably did again <laughs> anyway guys thank you for watching end of video see ya peace bye